Okay, I'm going to take a little video on, on how to remove your hard drive from an HP and I'll show you step by step. The one I'm working on today is the HP Pavilion. It's the DV7 2273CL Entertainment Notebook. Anyway, we're going to take out the hard drive and put it in a new hard drive. Flip it over and on the back uh, you'll see a couple different sections. This is the battery here, so you want to remove that. Um, get that out of there. It's already unplugged and so now there's no power, now there's no power going to the unit. And then you'll take your screwdriver. There's two sections here. Uh, there's three before with the battery, but now we got the big giant section here and you got a smaller section here. Um, both contain different things and our hard drive is under this one here. Okay, so we're going to take this one off. Now when you take these screws off, you don't take them all the way out. You just, you just simply unscrew them a little bit and uh, then it's the screws stay in. You don't, they don't come all the way out. Uh, they got a little lock things on them, so they just you don't need to take them all the way out. Okay, once you pull, once you do your screws, then you simply just pull off, just pull this thing here off. It's got little tabs. See the little tabs here? Uh, it's got a couple little tabs now and again that hold it secure, but the screws stay in. You can see the screws right here. The screws stay in and uh, the little tabs just hold it a little bit tight and then you just pop it right back on. Kind of like a, a smartphone, you know, a back cover or something, kind of like that. Anyway, so you got your hard drive here and there's no screws to take out. There's nothing to do. Um, you simply just pull it out. And uh, we're going to do that right now. Okay, so you simply just pull it out and uh, there's in the back here, there's two little rubber things that just kind of fit tight. They fit, uh, they form fit kind of, you know, and they come right out. Uh, the whole thing comes out, it's one big unit. And uh, they're just kind of fitting them tight in there. Just pull them out of there. And uh, then, uh, I can read. Uh, it's hard to do with one hand. <laughs> I hold the video camera with okay, the other. Okay, we'll continue with that. Uh, I need to get my other hand in here, so. Pull that thing up a little bit, and uh, you see it comes right up. And it's just it's a lot easier with two hands. So if you have two hands, you're way better off than me. Anyway, you set it aside like that. You'll notice right here, at the end, there's a little tab. Okay, see the tab right there? Pull that tab up, and that, that's, a, that's your connector for it. Okay, see the little tab thing right there? That thing just fits right in, right in there. Okay, so that's the whole thing. There's nothing there. It's just kind of form fit because of the little rubber nipples here. Uh, little rubber nipples, they kind of fit in there tightly and the little tab holds it in there. and it just It's just well made and well fit. So you don't have to do anything with it. Then you take your new one and put it in here. Bring it over. And you want to just set it aside again and put your uh, tab in. Okay, a little tab goes in that little hole right there. Okay, you see the little hole? hole is right there and the tab goes right in it. Uh, I can't do it with two, one hand so I'll show you. Okay so anyway once you got your tab in there you take uh, you take your tab put it in just put it in a little slot you can see the little receiver it has for it push it right in there then you just take your hard drive slide it in a little bit see the little uh, goes underneath there with little little nipples all right there's little rubber nipples just stick them in a little bit farther slides in until this one here just pushes in and once this form fit you're in business. So it's just uh, it's just real simple. Push them down. Um, you're all you're in business here. I'm going to go ahead and just push that one down a little bit more. It looks like it's off at an angle. Okay. So it's all done. These ones here, uh, the little rubber, these, one, these are the same rubber nipples on either side. And these ones here just fit underneath the flanges here. Okay, so you got a flange here and a flange here. And they just fit underneath, and this one here just drops down. And that's it. And now the new hard drive's in. Uh, everything's done. And we'll start it right up. Well, there you go. That's about a five-minute job from start to finish. And uh, it's just simply back in business. And it uh, doesn't even know, the, you know, the computer doesn't even know that anything happened. You know, you just pull out one hard drive, put in another hard drive, and you're just all set. You get to start your windows, and uh, everything's, everything's perfect. 
So uh, if you're putting in a brand new hard drive, you know, you're going to have to reconfigure, you're going to have to configure it and stuff. But if you're just swip swapping out hard drives like I had to do, then it's already set and the old one's already done. Anyway, simple Simon Metapyman, and I hope this works for you guys.